it's your boy T-Bear, who knew reaction. Today is music Monday. I was going to do a Nova poll for this, but uh, first thing first, about to check out some Rhythm Roulette. Now, I was going to do another poll for New Rhythm, Rhythm Roulette, but aside then, I did want, I did say in my last video at the Washington um, XLs on the live from the Sprite Corner, I saw this person on there, I like, it's, I, I, it's, it's always good to check out a female producer, you know, just, this will be my third female producer that did a Rhythm Roulette in a way. First one being Sarah the Illustrament, you know, her was like a uh, Master Pill Rhythm Roulette, but it was like her own, but still she went, she did this kind of, her, kind of the same with uh, how they do on Master Pill, and my second being Wonder Girl, so she'd be my third all together. This person will be my third altogether uh, th female producer from R Mass Appeal, but second, well, well, I'm sorry, with Rendell Roulette, and second via Mass Appeal. And this is uh, Georgia Ann Muldrow. And I don't know too much about her, but again, it's always good to see a female uh, lady counterpart in our game. I try to, I'm try i trying to say female too much, you know, some people take saying the word female to offense, you know, but yeah. Um, but yeah, female music producer, when it comes to a, a person application, a female, a female music producer, that's okay. But just can't use it too much. But anyway, let's check out Georgia and Mojo. So what I thought to do, and this is uh, one, another one from the live from the, court, the Sprite Corner. Let's get it. Rhythm Roulette. Cool. Before we go further, I like when I when I check out somebody that's I've never seen before, I like to check out what they what their library is. So let me see Georgia and Georgia. Let's see who she known for like as far as like um one she's from Cali. She represents Cali. She knows we do a lot of folk blues, neo soul hip hop. So it's gonna be good. Lay man with a fellow artist and former husband D Dilly Park Perkins. Uh, D claim. All right, she's from Cali, but anyway, she's repping Cali. So, I'm trying to figure out she ain't seen anything that I may know for know her for guest appearances. Uh, she did someone. Oh no, okay. An um, Erica Badu Master T-shirt. Mm -hmm. She did thing with Muff. She did some. Oh, she did a couple songs on um Erica Badu's uh New America Part One, as well as Most Def. Okay, she worked with Most Def. Oh, she's the Miles da Davis and. Okay. She definitely got it. Uh, oh, she rocked. She, she rocked. With, she did a remix for uh, Brittany Howard. Nice. All right. Definitely want to see what she got going on. Let's get it. I probably got to use my my stationary intro for it though. Cause I might. I, I, I'll be. I doubt I have any music by her though. But I'm definitely want to get to know her. So we're back oh, she a keyboard the user. Right corner, and I'm gonna see what kind of juice I can get out of here. Okay, so she's a, she's another keyboard look. user. Nice. I'm going. I, I should have figured that because her style is more soul, jazz fusion, and neo soul. So yeah. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Nice. She's more a musician style producer. So yeah. No. <laughs> she said no. no. <laughs> Like she get into it when she hear it, like yeah, that's that's how you do it. No, that organ was doing it for me though. What? Her shit look advanced as fuck. Her shit look advanced as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. I don't even know what program she's using. The fact that the fact that I don't know what program she's using, I feel like I got a feeling she gonna she gonna be a beast. She's top down level. What the hell? Stop that from playing. That's incredible. Mm. Okay. 
impressing me already. Yeah, I know that's right. Give her her props. Let's see what else we got here. Let's see what else we got here. She killed that joint quick. What is this? All right, so one, two, three. It's all music to me. I don't care. <laughs> no worries. Hers definitely is, I will say this, hers is a little inspirational, I will say that though, because she's, how different it is and anything, you know, cause, you know, I like to experiment with a lot of, I've been experimenting with a lot of other stuff on my joint though, and everything, so yeah. She's like the type for me. One, one game like she's the type that's like been a musician her whole life, playing with bands, probably play with bands and all that. So with a keyboard or a different type of instrument, and all that, and you know this and producing became a thing. Like you know, like most like me being a DJ, getting a producer, like guys like that, or DJ Premier or a rapper being a producer that was into that that had like musical background as a kid, but. But you know, got to hit like Eric Sermon and all that. Like she, she's like saying she's like the type that like you know, like will play a live keyboard, like live whatever instrument live and everything. Cause by just about her style of production, like she renotes, like she literally renotes. That was. This is Georgia Ann Muldrow. I might Muldrow. have survived Rhythm Roulette, but I'm not sure. She, no, she did her, you did your thing. You did your thing. I think I did, I think I really, really reacted to everybody that did it at the Sprite Corner. So, yeah, I did Main Fresh, Just Plays, and last week I did Exile. So, yeah, she did her thing. Her was definitely inspirational as well, too, because it was different. You know, she, it's like, you know, it's like something that's not typical. I, I see on the mask. Well, there's some other ones I see different stuff. Is this another different, unique style? I see a uh, mask pill. That's one thing about these, uh, rhythm that you, they co you can get to check out different styles of production to help you, you know, inspire you, help you do with to figure out which style you want to go with. You know what I mean, or you, then again, as a producer, you should always, you know, experiment different sound to find your sound. That's what I'm kind of doing as well, too. Cause I, um, I made like beats like, I made a house style B in a way. I made a a boom bat. Crazy and bought a trap one. <laughs> I think that made a trap one. I'm trying to make a trap one. Surprisingly, I thought it'd be the easiest one. That's kind of like the somewhat the hardest one. I made some boom bat style. Even made some new jack old school style. Even one little eighty style B as well too. So yeah, um, just by your sound, you know, or be versatile. The producer like didn't need, so you won't they. The, so post so people won't expect this type of style from you when you make a beat so yeah hers was very different so other than that if you like my reaction like share subscribe to my youtube channel it's your boy t-bear signing off one love